So what's different about this skit is that it's based on a true story. Why is this one special? You see, now we're having original stories. Kevin with his brother and them coming on a journey together. From the U-turn saga that we just had before back in January, now we're going into deeper paths, deeper journeys in which we create branches and storylines. So now that you've seen what we're doing, you can expect much more detailed stories, characters, people involved in the action. Hey, hey guys, if you've had any issues, please take it outside. I'm not dealing with this. It's already been the third fight tonight. So how did we choose the characters? You know, these are people that you are familiar with. They're people that you already know. And that's the thing, we know them. We know what they can do, they, we know what they can provide, we know their attitude, their, you know, behavior. So we made a very clear, you know, criteria of what we were looking for when it comes to the characters' personalities. Now, of course, for Kevin, you know, we had him already in the January skit, but for Alex, who is now playing as Chris, that's a different story. You know, we had to branch out and be, pick on someone that is new and fresh and someone that we can rely on. So he will be a main character going into the future. Bro, we're no bros. All right, chill, man. You really want to start something with me? Obviously, not all of them are main characters. There's some characters there that we involved that are also just there for the moment, you know, for that specific skit. Those are the moments that, you know, are more funny, laid back, because we want to make sure that these skits also have some kind of comedy to it to make it more engaging and interesting for you guys to watch. So when it comes to the character that Sammy's playing, some random character that we made up that has a Russian stereotype. And the thing is, is that it really added to that value of having Kevin and his brother fighting against someone who typically, you know, when you hear Russian, it's a bit, you know, comedic and funny. So we wanted to add a little touch on that. Then of course, Becky, you know, she's the bartender. She's a very good person to, you know, provide the service of, you know, being at the bar. Now, of course, that doesn't mean that she does that in person at real, you know, situations. But the idea is that we try to use these opportunities that we can create with the characters and do them, make them do things that are out of the usual, but very fascinating for us to see how can they put that in action. And you see, Tryon's character is very interesting too. He's the oldest out of all of us that we used in the, in the skit. And he had a very big value and a big role in that skit, even though he's not a main character. He was playing as a homeless man in which he was, you know, showing the consequences as to a person who doesn't take care of his life, as a person who doesn't want to take that U-turn to God. So of course this comes with great responsibility because what we're doing at the end of the day is trying to provide the most realistic events that you know can relate to real life. So we want to present that in the most realistic fashion as we can. Now of course we're also going to be you know thinking about how we plan these things for the future. We want to make sure that we do even better than we just did, which is already to a good enough standard. And of course this comes with preparation. You know, we started back in August. We started talking and having meetings, me and Christy especially, and we talked about what could we do with these characters, where could we bring them in the future. And you know, we had rehearsals, and those rehearsals were also a lot of time investment. We did our best, and I'm sure that you guys can see that effort being put into action. So, you know, I really hope you guys enjoyed what we showed here and you know what is next. I know you guys will be very excited for and you know, it's all a surprise at the end of the day. Okay, so for me, it was a brand new experience. I, I loved it and I'm sure that I'll never forget it. This will be in my mind for a really long time and um, I'm sure that a lot of you enjoyed it and it was the most fun thing I've done so far and we acted together, we had fun, it was really informational as well and I'm sure that the ones that we will do in the future will be even better and I'm sure most of you will enjoy it and have fun and yeah, that's yeah, it. we had to take uh, initiative in some in some aspects because we were learning our lines and we, Kevin and I, we were sending each other our lines. Then we had to like go out and buy some stuff. Uh, it was all a combined effort, and it was really funny actually. It was for me especially, given that it was my first experience. I know you've uh, had a previous skit, but this one was very funny, especially in the bloopers. As you guys will see, it's extremely amusing. It's very funny. I have, I have, uh... <laughs> No, no, just, just like school. Oh, and then, yeah, and, and the homeless man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I believe that this one is much funnier because that one was live as well. We had live, those were planned jokes, but like well, now that we've recorded, it was like bloopers yeah, behind yeah, the yeah. scenes and those things. Like, 
gag reel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really funny now, some of those jokes, the way they came out was, was just pure, yeah. pure banter. Pure. And the ideas to create them, for example, Igor, that was mm. a moment idea. Like, we were just thinking, we were having fun, we were just brainstorming, yeah. throwing ideas, and everything just came to yeah. life. And it was really fun and inspiring, and yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I would agree, yeah. With God, religion won't get you anywhere. Yeah. Say that yeah. very clearly. Religion won't get yeah. you anywhere. You know why? Also, Sespona Asta in another in another clip. I have no signal for my data. I need a PC. <laughs> 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 Anything else I'm missing? I've been. I'm sorry I sent so many messages on the group, but if I don't say anything, nothing will happen. I, I have to say something. Thank you.